Now we're going to get into concealers. This is one of my like most requested, most asked about is concealers. I don't know why. I don't know what. I guess y'all want the fluids under eye, but here this spilled the tea. So first product. I love this product. This is the Makeup Forever HG Skin Palette. This is a pricey palette. This palette instantly blew me away when I first tried it. It is for good reason. This is the colors they have. They do have darker palettes on their website, but this is the one that I have. Um, when I'm telling you the formulation, the blendability, the pristine, it's just, it's so good. The formula is amazing. The blend is amazing. It's just a 10 out of 10 out of 10. You can use this a multi-use. You can use it for many different things. You can use it to contour, to highlight. And they have like shimmering highlights. It's so pretty. You must try it. It's gorgeous. It's worth the price. And I highly, highly recommend. This blew me away out of all the concealers for 2023. I'm sorry. A lot of concealers were good this year. But this right here, this palette right here, took the cake for me. Um, I'm also going to talk about a few other concealers on here. Um, this I bought. This is the Hourglass Concealer. I purchased this um, after the viral video with Amaya. This is a beautiful concealer. It's gorgeous. It's stunning. It's pretty. It goes out. It full covers. It blends like a dream. What more can you ask for? It's a stunning concealer. And I highly, highly recommend. This one... I purchased during the sale. This is the Kofi Concealer. This concealer was a 10 out of 10 for me. Um, I love the blendable Dofa applicator, but the coverage on this and the way it blends is just so good. Um, and it's an affordable concealer as well. It is a Sephora. I would highly recommend you trusting it. This is in the shade, I'm sorry, Extra Elache in Hourglass. This is Flax. Um, I'm loving this concealer. I use it for to brighten up under my eye. I love it, love it, love it. Couldn't say any more good things about this concealer. This one I've had, but I revisited this this year. Um, and this was just as good. Huda, her concealer in cookie dough. I have been using this. This has been uh, on repeat. When I do my makeup every single day on live, everybody can use it me to do this. This is Huda's um, concealer. It's a full coverage concealer. It's beautifully done. I fell in love with it. When I first tried it, I wasn't crazy about it. I fell back in love with this this year. And it really has been a staple and in rotation in my makeup application. And that completes my concealers for 2023.